Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Christy. Today I have a Dollar Tree haul for you guys and I'm gonna show you every little thing that I got and the reason I'm doing this is this is what happens when you take your two dollars with you to the Dollar Tree. I don't suggest it. <laughs> if you're not subscribed please go ahead and do so because I'd love to have you as a member of my YouTube family and also make sure you follow me on Instagram for sneak peeks and updates on Quincy, which he is doing really well. Um, I do have several new items that I wanna show you, and I have a review of a new foundation I have been trying, and this one is the Eve Saint Laurent, and it is the All Hours Foundation. So make sure you stay till the very end so I can tell you all about this. Quincy, what are you doing? Okay, of course I'm gonna start with my favorite and you might even be able to guess what it is. New socks. These are not a Greenbrier brand. These are not Dollar Tree socks. These are called Just Saying, Just Saying, Just Saying, Just Saying, yeah. So here's what it looks like. Um, it says socks that make a statement. They're adult unisex. These are extremely thick, very high quality socks. Um, let's see what it says. They are made in China, great quality socks that feel good and say how you feel. Okay, so here is the first pair. I'm loving the colors. This is like so Dr. Seuss colors. I'm gonna assume this is eggs. Is that what y'all think? I'm not sure, but definitely Dr. Seuss colors. So I picked this one up. The other one is a paper airplanes and they're yellowish green sort of. The blue sock obviously and the red toe and heel um, and also at the very top thought these were really adorable. Now this one is a little different. This one is an outdoor casual men's sock and it's one pack crew. Um, sock size 10 to 13, shoe size 6 to 12 and it says socks that make a statement. Again, they're called Just Sayin'. And here is your socks. Here's the top band. So when you have your feet propped up, you're going to be able to read this. And I'm going to think it says Mountains are calling. Let's go like this. I know it's not calling mountains are. So I think it's mountains are calling. <laughs> um, this was the only pair that they had like this. And this was the only two pair that they had. Um, so I got one of each. I'm not sure if I'm going to give them to Chris or Preston. Probably not. I may just save these for Christmas gifts since they are a name brand. Seriously, it's only 70 degrees. But the humidity out here is horrific okay i showed these two items in the come with me to the dollar tree i'll have that linked for you guys in the description box and in the um little i cards up here if you want to check it out but look how huge these are i don't think you could tell in that video how big these are these are the main street totes again not a dollar tree uh brand this is a name brand and these are little cosmetic bags well i should say huge cosmetics bags they feel like they're made out of a, a material that would not allow them to leak, if you know what I mean. What's this one called? This one is called the X-Ray Ombre. And on this one, it looks like it's definitely going through an X-Ray machine. I did not even notice that when I picked these up. And you can see what's in the bag. So it's got like sunglasses and makeup, keys and candy, earrings, nail polish, all that good stuff. Is that not cute? love that one then the other one that they had here it is and this one is called x-ray camera it's got the camera the sunglasses key ring with eiffel tower we actually have a key ring just like this um a bracelet pineapple earphones lipstick all that good stuff um and i picked these up for the girls to take with us on vacation so well, we, we both, well, no, we all four take a carry on and then we take our personal item and inside our personal item, we will put things that we may need throughout the flight, like 
headphones or chapstick and things like that. Um, and they'll just put those in a backpack. They have new old Williamsburg candles in, and these are the gelato scented candles. I picked up the one that is double caramel. It was one of two that they had. The other one I believe was cookies and cream. If you want to look at the come with me to the Dollar Tree can, but it didn't have an, a strong of a scent as this one. So I was worried that it wouldn't have a great throw. This one smells so strong on cold sniff. So I went ahead and picked it up. These are tiny. Some of the tiniest candles I think I have seen from Old Williamsburg, but I'm excited to see how it smells. I will probably burn that maybe even starting tonight. So make sure you stick around for next month's um, Dollar Tree Empties video if you want to review on this one. They had in some bandages and you know I'm always picking them up, especially when they're the name brand. These are the Curad and you get 25 bandages in this one. Bandages at Walmart or anywhere else are insane. So I always pick them up when they have them at Dollar Tree. These are the Camp Camo Flexible Fabric Bandages and they're tough, durable protection, 25 bandages, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'm just gonna see what they look like, yeah. And of course, I'll probably be packing things like this to take with us too. Here they are, are those not adorable? So make sure you're always checking out their band-aids and bandages there because you will not find them cheaper anywhere else. Okay, at my last come with me to the Dollar Tree trip, I found several new kitchen towels. That's exactly what they say. But this one is the one I fell in love with. And of course, I did not walk out without it. This is from the Home Collection. It is 15 by 25 inches. And it says, a house is not a home without paw prints. It is that micro fiber feel, and I'm not a fan of those to use to dry things with, but I'm definitely gonna hang this over the little um, rack, either on my toaster oven or um, on my stove and just let it hang there as decor, or maybe on the bar, I'm not sure. But loved this one. It's gray print with black paw prints, and then it's got this gray stripe. It does have it on both sides. I think I've seen recently where people are doing tons of DIYs with these. So if you're thinking about doing something like that, you might want to pick them up as soon as you see them. These things go so fast. <laughs> and then Kerrigan picked up a thing of her favorite lashes. I think I've mentioned these in the past, but she loves the LA Colors Dramatal Lash. These are like her absolute favorite. Every t Well, there's several different designs, but I just picked up the one that says Diva. Um, and they're of course black. Every time she wears this brand of lashes, people compliment her about them. I mean, it's just amazing for $1. Okay, let me go ahead and show you what Briley picked up when we went. Got a pair of the Mike and Ike brand headphones. Are those not just so adorable? These are made in China. They're ages three and up and they are by the Just Born Company. I'm pretty sure those are the ones that do Mike and Ike and Peeps and stuff like that. But I got these for her to throw in that little travel bag and that way when we're on the plane and she's watching Netflix or Hulu or something, um, she'll be able to do that without disturbing anyone. I from what I can tell, we're gonna have to definitely unhook that, but she'll put this part around her ankle and it'll be sort of like a jump rope for your foot. So you'll just twist this around your ankle and this is gonna fly all the way around you and then you're supposed to jump it every time. They make these in a name brand, which is much more than a dollar. But seriously, I didn't want to put that much money into one because I don't even know if she's going to like it or not. If she ends up loving this one and it tears up or something, I'll buy her another one, but I'm going to test it out first and see how it works. I have bought a hundred of these, but apparently I never bought the yellow ones. These are the foam beads and they're in the craft section. They're by Crafters Square, but Briley uses these every time she makes foam or if she makes um, slime or something like that, she'll put these in it and loves them. And these are so much cheaper at Dollar Tree than they are anywhere else. Sorry, I had to rotate a little bit. I realized the lighting was getting horrible. It's getting late. Okay, another item that she picked up was one of these lip glosses. And this one is the Sweet Peach Scent. And look at that. It's a flamingo. Is that not just 
too cute got like a little crown on its head it's so cute again it says apply directly to lips it is Greenbrier she's just gonna take this on vacation with us because each one of my kids myself and probably Chris we all take our own chapstick we're obsessed with chapstick and socks what can I say so um went ahead and let her pick that one up because I thought it'd be cute for vacation and then I have no idea how this got in there and I know who picked it up these are the Wack-a-Pack surprise greetings Here's what they look like. You get four in here. Um, they're four self-inflating balloons. Um, four years and up, non-toxic. You take these out, you basically just smack it or hit it as hard as you can with your hand and then it sort of inflates and I don't know. It says balloon inflates before your eyes. I don't know. And then it's got the, even the little string on here. I'm not even sure. They just saw them and had to have them and apparently I was not paying good enough attention. Okay, this is a repurchase. I showed this in a haul not long ago, but I wanted to let you guys know that I love these. So that's why I went ahead and purchased another one. These are the Cascade Dishwasher Cleaners. You get two uses. You get one for each month. So you get two months worth here. Um, it says that they are a fresh scent, easy dose of packs, help eliminate lime scale. But I liked it because it made my dishwasher smell so good. You know how dishwashers just get that odor sometimes? This helped a lot. Again, you're only supposed to use one a month. So now I've still got three left, so three months worth. So I'm fine with that. Um, they did, I noticed when I opened the dishwasher down at the very bottom where the little drain is, um, it's like this was still left. The little packet that it's in it didn't completely dissolve, so I just pulled it out and threw it away instead of leaving it. But really like these. It says they're a great value, so I'm not sure what they are anywhere else, but to me, they're definitely worth a dollar. And then look what I finally found. I finally found a pack of multi-surface cleaning wipes. I know they'd changed the package and I hope they're exactly the same because I loved it when they were in the other ones. I showed them in my last empties video. I just uploaded my maze empties. It's gonna start barking. But these have always worked so good on my stainless steel refrigerator and stuff like that. And I always liked them for my glass cleaner. Um, I'll just wipe everything down with these. I mean, they don't disinfect, but they do sort of leave everything looking fresh and clean. You get 24 wipes in these, and I know they have them in like your furniture polish one, your glass cleaner one, because I picked this one up first before I found this one, because I was afraid I wasn't gonna be able to find that one. So I went ahead and got this one. I'm just gonna throw this one in the bathroom. This is the glass cleaning one. And then every time I wanna clean it, that thing gets toothpaste all over it. I don't know how, because apparently my kids don't know how to brush their teeth, I assume. Um, so I love to wipe it down with these, but I'm definitely gonna just save these for like the stainless steel appliances. But I love these. Again, I've not tried it since they switched the packages up, but I'm hoping it's the exact same formula. Okay guys, if you have not tried these, you definitely need to. I mean, for me, they're just such a time saver. I say what, like a 0.5 seconds of my life. Um, these are the Reynolds Wrap Pre-Cut Pop-Up Foil Sheets and you get 25 in here. These are perfect for your toaster oven and that's what I use them for. So I don't have to worry about it. If one of the kids is putting something in the toaster oven, I don't have to worry about them, you know, pulling out a piece of aluminum full as long as I am. These just pull straight out. They just line up the little tray with the foil and it just fits amazing. I absolutely love these and I have them all the time. Pretty sure. I don't think it made it to my last empties. It'll be in my next one. And like I said, I'm showing you guys everything this time. I love these straws. These are an 80 piece straw set and I don't have to buy them that often. And they're in the neon colors, but do you know why these are great? Do you see how long these are? These are so long. These are like above and beyond your normal length of straw. 
and that's why I like them. Plus, they've got the long, flexible part that's the bendy. But here's what I drink out of all day long. And this is a huge Tervis. So this holds like 20 some ounces. But if I put a regular straw in here, it only comes to right here. And so, you know, that's not good. So this one, I have that much room where it's so long. And even if I want more, I can just pull it out if I want to and get it bendier and have all this room. But this, if you drink out of a huge cup like I do, these are the straws you're gonna want. Riley also wanted one of the Nestle Splash, and these are in Wildberry. There is a six pack here of bottled water. Um, they also had this available in the lemon. I don't buy tons of water. I buy a Tervis, and then we just fill it up with whatever we want to drink, usually filtered water out of the refrigerator. But sometimes, you know, it's just more convenient when you're walking out of the house and you're packing a bag to throw in a bottle of water. She has already opened it so that she could try one. She said on a scale of one to 10, I think she gave it like a six. She did drink the whole thing though, if that tells you anything. I mean, a 10 year old and she did drink it. Um, so I was really shocked because I bought flavored waters in the past for her like years ago and she would not have anything to do with them. But she did this one so if you guys like these two let me know and tell me if the lemon one was any good i may consider it for her okay the very last thing that i picked up was one of the pantene expert intense hydrating shampoos this was a big mistake i mean um, i got it for one reason and one reason only it smells amazing but that wasn't it i got it because i thought oh that's small and I can just throw it in my carry-on when we go to travel. Not thinking. And when I got home, I looked at the size and it's 3.9 ounces. And that's just a teeny tiny bit over your TSA guidelines. So this is going to be a big no-no. I guess I will just put this in the pantry with all of our other travel things that are like this and this will be one we take on a vacation when we just drive somewhere or if we go stay somewhere overnight but definitely not for when we fly uh, but it is Pantene it says it instantly um, instantly quench with moisture um, again 3.9 fluid ounces and it is an intense hydrating shampoo and it's the Pro-V love Pantene but I wouldn't have got it if I'd have realized it was 3.9 fluid ounces Okay, I do have a review for you guys really quick today, and it is the Yves Saint Laurent All Day Hours Foundation. And I did team up with Octoly. I found this on their site. They went ahead and sent it to me. This was gifted to me to give you guys a review and let you know my honest opinion. I have been one of these people who have not really wore foundation probably in the last three years. I started my skincare journey then, and I've just had issues with dry skin so i just wear usually a tinted moisturizer but re but here in the last like two months i've really been searching high and low for a good foundation i want just a regular one that has lots of skincare help in it and then i wanted another one that is more of a how would we say sort of a full coverage i'm going out at night kind of thing this is it so again, this was given to me free to give you guys a review on, and I have been wearing it for several weeks now. Again, this is the Yves Saint Laurent's All Hour Foundation. It does have an SPF of 20 in it, and it is up to 24 hour wear, which I can't even imagine wearing foundation for 24 hours. Um, flawless matte, full coverage, and oil free. And let me just tell you guys, you can see where I've used it a lot. It smells so good. Not like a very strong scent because I don't like to have a lot of fragrance in my skincare, but it's just sort of like a clean scent. You know how some foundations just reek? This is not one of them. So let me just tell you a little bit about this. I do apply it with a damp beauty blender and it does say on the site, which shocks me, it is fragrance free, free of mineral oil, no sulfates, no parabens. Um, it, that's just um, amazing. It seems like they put a lot of effort into this. 
I think it comes in like 33 shades. The one that I have here, it looks like it says BR20, which is ivory. It even has the expiration date on the bottom, which I think is odd. A lot of times it doesn't. And it says to shake well before use. I have had this on since this morning. Let me look and see what time it is. It is 620. Look, 628. Can you see that? 628. I've had this on all morning and the coverage is just absolutely amazing. And usually I'm one of these people who have to blot and get all this extra oil off because I get extremely oily right here. I mean, okay, it's humid out here and all, but it's still not bad. Like I would assume it would be after having this on for probably seven hours now. I am so impressed. This one's definitely going on vacation with me since it is a matte wear and you know it's going to be so humid there. Um, but the fact that it's going to stay on and I don't have to worry about probably sweating it off because I have sweated today. It's been so hot. So I'm loving this. This is probably my new favorite. Hey, I want to look really good tonight foundation. Again, I just want to thank Yves Saint Laurent and Octalie for sending me this free so that I could give you my honest opinion and guys, I'm loving it. So all the links to this product will be down in the description box if you just want to go check it out. Uh, this is, did I tell you? It's 0 0.84 fluid ounces. What you doing, buddy? Huh? Look up here at Mama. <laughs> Quincy. Quincy Doodle. He refuses to look at me when I have the camera on him now. Quincy. Come here. What are you doing, baby? <clears throat> Quincy. Hi, baby. What are you doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Him Mama's boy. Him Mama's boy. He is probably 80% better. Because I know a bunch of y'all have been wanting an update. Um, I'm still getting up in the middle of the night sometimes. And he's had some issues uh, keeping his food down. But it's only happening maybe once a day now. We're still working on that. Trying to change his foods around and figure out what's going on with him. Yes, we are. But as far as friskiness and everything, he seems like he's getting back to his old self. Yes, yes you are. Tell him bye. Tell him thank you, first of all, for all the well wishes and prayers and all that good stuff. Yeah, tell him thank you. Say thank you. Say, I need to go to the groomer really bad, but mommy's not going to put me through anything else until I'm 110% better. Yeah. Okay, that's all I've got for this Dollar Tree haul. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video. Please make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell, because I don't even want to know what's going on with you two lately. I am getting messages from a ton of you saying that you're not getting your notifications, you're not seeing my videos, and what's going on. It's not me. Believe me. It's YouTube. So make sure you hit that notification bell, so every time I upload, you will find out immediately. Okay, I will see you in my next video, and I hope everyone has a great day. Bye.